The National Aeronautics and Space Administration, or NASA, prepares to launch a spacecraft which will intentionally crash into an asteroid. Joselito Liquido tells us why, live. Yes, Joselito, please go ahead. Good evening, Marielle. NASA's double asteroid redirection test, also known as DART mission, would be the first space operation to test an asteroid deflection to stop space objects from hitting Earth. The mission is part of the planetary defense after, meteor after a meteor exploded in over Russia in 2013, creating shockwaves across the country. DART is planned to launch in November 23 aboard a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket from Space Force based in California. It involves sending a high-speed spacecraft into an asteroid's orbit to change its motion by crashing into it. The near-Earth asteroid Didymos and its moonlet will be the target of this mission, according to Cleomenes Ciganis, a member of the DART team and a scientist who suggested that the moonlet would be named Dimorphos. This would be the first celestial object to change due to humanity. After the initial launch, the spacecraft is expected to collide in September 2022 when the asteroid system is within 11 million kilometers from Earth to enable ground observations. Meanwhile, the European Space Agency will launch mission HERA two years after the DART mission to study Didymos and Dimorphos after the collision. Riel? Pasolito, what is the concept behind crashing a spacecraft to enable asteroid deflection? Marielle, crashing a spacecraft into an asteroid at high speed is a demonstration of what is called the kinetic impact technique. It actually aims to change the orbit of any near-Earth objects or NEOs which are close to unhitting our planet. In the upcoming DART mission, the crash is expected to change the time it takes to the moonlit Dimorphos to orbit Didymus. Back to you, Marielle. Thank you, Joselito Liquido, for that live report.